That's right. Today's the day we're going to be building a custom rainforest. Now, Puff is a mighty fine guy. I mean, he's pretty awesome, actually, because he built this awesome looking pyramid. Uh, but he's got a lot of blank space around here, and he wanted me to fill it in with trees because he built this for us, this bone meal farm and a moss farm right back there. You can see the red. And uh, as payment, he wanted me to build him some custom trees, some custom rainforest trees, which I think are going to be really cool. I kind of got a design laid out. All I need to do now is just collect the resources. So after collecting some resources, I got some trees put up here just to show you guys kind of what we're going to be building in terms of the trees for the rainforest. And I was looking up some Google images of rainforest and the trees are chaotic. <laughs> they're not like your normal custom trees that you would see in Minecraft. No, they're completely different from any custom tree that I have done in Minecraft. Um, but that's exciting because it challenges me. It, it gets me more motivated to want to try and build it uh, because it's totally different from any tree that I've built. Uh, first, I started off building this tree because I'm like, well, this kind of looks tropical, right? This kind of looks like a kind of like a, a tropical-ish dense kind of tree, but it's still sort of similar to my uh, other custom trees that I did. And I'm like, mm, I'm not sure if this is what Puff was imagining, right? Yeah, it might have been OK. You might have liked it, but I really wanted to take it to the next level and challenge myself to build something a little bit more exotic than that and really do my research and really look for what does a rainforest tree look like? So rainforest, they have these dense trees in them, which is, you know, still accurate, but they also have like these scrawny ones that kind of peek out of the, the dense trees like this one, the dense trees, and they kind of loom above the top a little bit. And they only have a little bit of leaves on the top and then maybe a couple little branches just starting to grow down below. And that's kind of what they look like. If you Google rainforest, that's, that's what I at least saw. Um, and so I just tried to replicate that and boy, <laughs> I am really happy with these custom trees. I, I gotta say, I think they really turned out pretty fantastic, uh, for really not really knowing what I was doing. I was just kind of following an image, uh, uh, you know, of a rainforest and I'm like, okay, maybe this will, maybe this will look good. So this is what I came up with. Hopefully you guys like it. What's great about these custom trees as well is that you can adjust the height. So if I just sink the schematic into the ground a little bit, you got a different, you know, uh, height of a custom tree. So they're very customizable. You can basically, I'm just going to use one tree throughout this whole thing and just rotate it and then lower the heights up and down. And it'll look like I got a bunch of different custom trees designed. Um, I did design two of these different trees. Um, so we'll have a little bit of variety in that department. Um, but yeah, I think we're set in the tree department for the rainforest. Who's a little piggy? Hi, ah, me. I'm a little piggy. Hey, Puff, we're going to show you these trees, okay? Uh, okay. Should I, should I log in? Come on, buddy. No, don't log in. I'm showing you right now. Oh, wow. Look at these trees, man. I, Aren't they I good, go Puff? Right about now. Could, do you have a carrot, by the way? Um, not. I have a spectral arrow. No, no, no. Do you have a carrot, by the way? No, I know carrots. You what may about, have some like, in your pyramid, but... What about like a potato or something, you know, like... Oh, actually. Skunk has a carrot, it's just... Oh, oh, oh. Is it a golden one? Oh, man, I could go for one. No, yeah. it's not. It's not a golden one. Sorry. I'll take a regular one, too. Just drop it. Just give give me that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, there you go. Thanks, that's... Yeah, oh. no problem. That'll... That'll... That'll be scrumptious. Man, that, that was gonna tasty. hurt him, Skunk. Uh, no, it's not. It won't hurt him. He'll be fine. Ow, what is that? It hurts, whatever it is. I don't even know what it is. No, no, just, just Ow. hold on Ow. to it. Don't, don't try to eat it. It's going to prick his inside skunk. No. It's going to prick my insides. What are you talking? Ow. <laughs> so you got these nice trees right here, Puff, as you can see, if you look up, you know. Oh, lines of sight, lines of sight. Lines of sight being I, in order here. 
what and oh. uh they're looking is good that, aren't is they that, is that purple block right there what is that no no i think you're blind um it's a mangrove 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 yeah really? man mangrove and uh some jungle oh ooh, mm -hmm. jungle mm -hmm. so does this grow any like coconuts or diamonds or anything cool like that uh potentially yeah yeah oh it, these trees oh. are pretty uh you know exotic so could oh, definitely exotic grow, definitely could grow some fruit Man. for you okay can i log in yet <laughs> yes bob you can log <laughs> in <laughs> I, I spent a lot of time designing them. I looked up rainforest trees and I was like, man, these are exotic and weird and I'm going to try and replicate them. And man, man, I'm liking it. I'm liking it a lot. Let's, let's get a nice bird's eye view. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's good. That's good. <laughs> um, so Very I wasn't nice. sure if you wanted me to do this other side as well. Uh, um, yeah, definitely do that side too. Definitely do this side. Okay. All right. No, it's okay. It's I okay. may have said on my stream that I might I might just start doing random trees around here whenever I feel like it. You know, I would uh I would gladly <laughs> appreciate that. But I will uh, pretend that I don't like it for the role play. What? He, he doesn't like it for the role play. Why don't you know, like, you like so it, like huh? all of a sudden all these trees are springing up everywhere, like mm. oh, right. we've been planting these trees. Yeah, okay, yes, role play. Yeah, 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 yeah. Get yeah. off my lawn, you know. But no, what do you I really mean? I already so told Skunk that he's supposed to because, you know, this is our base puff. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. This is the first I'm hearing of this. Yes, but look at this Thank puff you. down here. I want to show you this real quick. A line of sight. Lines, lines of sight. This is the whole, whole reason. Oh, dude. Yeah, this looks so good. Oh, yeah, walking through here, oh, man. you get to see. Yeah. Look at this. Perfect. You get to see the entrance right through here. I, I know. It's looking beautiful. It's looking magnificent. Mm -hmm. It's looking chef's kiss. Chef's kiss. So I've been going through here, adding in some other little details because, uh, you know, I was looking at these trees and I, I love them. You know, it's great. But then once you look down below, you start to realize that, you know, it's kind of barren, right? And I've already gone ahead and I, I asked Puff, I said, can I do a little bit more? You know, I wanted to make a custom rainforest. Is it cool? I know you got, you know, you like the trees. I know you're happy with the trees, but can I just do a little bit more? Can I, can I just play with it just a little bit? Um, cause I'm having fun over here. I really am. I'm enjoying this, uh, this different atmosphere, right? This is, this feels so nice. feels so good, uh, to be able to work somewhere else besides the base, to be honest. Um, uh, I love the base, but this, this is a nice little nice little change in the uh, atmosphere and in the area when i think of rainforest i think of like kind of damp very rainy of course so i was thinking maybe like ha by the river we'll have like a little bit more of a damper kind of atmosphere over here uh, a damper kind of terrain with maybe some moss kind of growing and uh you know we'll put some uh, plants in here as well just to kind of fill it in so some tall grass mixed with some just regular grass and I'm taking out these flowers that spawn in. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll leave these blue ones. They kind of look cool. And then I'm going to add in these bushes as well. I'm just going to add some azalea in just to add for a little touch of a different green. It also matches the moss pretty well. So I think that's going to be a nice little touch there. And then we can also do the, we could do the flowering azalea ones as well. Just, just every so often. And then I got these pitcher pods uh here uh to kind of add a little pop of uh cyan bluish kind of color um and it kind of looks exotic it looks like an exotic plant so i feel like that would fit a rainforest uh in some way but yeah that looks pretty cool and then we'll just go back in we'll fill in with some tall you know tall grass short grass whatever have you uh i wish this i wish this grass was jungle over here this is like the transition point like right over here is where the lush grass starts. It actually looks pretty good once you start adding all these like saturated colors in, like these uh pitcher pods and stuff like that. Oh, that already feels so much better. Holy smokes, I'll tell you. This looks so good. I think if Puff continues this little like ridge that he has going with like the stone and the mud, the packed mud along this edge here, this is really gonna look so, so cool. 
Uh, but yeah, this kind of just gives him an example of like what I had in mind for like a rainforest and all. Um, this is just looks, I, I love it. I, I'm so happy with how this turned out. Um, I hope he likes all these little details that I add. I think this just completes kind of the rainforest look. Now, as I said, I mean, rainforests are typically more dense than this. So you would have like trees like overlapping each other. Uh, but Puff wanted it a little bit more airy. So this is a little bit of a, it's a, you know, it's a custom rainforest. It's not going to be exactly like, like a rainforest or as dense, but I got to tell you, I am super happy with this. We may have to come back later on at some point, uh, maybe in future episodes and work on some more of this rainforest for Puff. But I think this is a good starting point. I, I'm really happy, especially with this view right here. This really, you can see all the little details now that we add it and you can see all the trees and all this good stuff. It's just all in combination. Oh, it looks so good. Uh oh, time to sleep. Don't mind me, Puff. Sorry, just got to use your bed real quick. Hopefully Puff doesn't see this. I, I don't know where my bed is. I forgot it somewhere. There's actually one more thing I think we could add to the rainforest if we didn't detail it enough. Bamboo, right? Nazarene has this bamboo shop over here. I think I've purchased from it before. Uh, maybe not. <laughs> maybe not. Uh, but I'm going to grab a few, couple stacks here. One diamond for two. One diamond for two stacks. Okay. Well, a couple stacks, I think, was all I'm going to... I'm really going to need. So we'll we'll grab a couple stacks here. And I think... Uh, is there a payment? Is, is this payment over here? I don't think so. We'll just, we'll just put it in here. That's fine. Perfect. Beautiful. And let's do a little fly back in onto the rainforest. Oh, that looks so cool. Hold on a minute. Hold on. Hold on. I gotta... We gotta do that again. <laughs> we gotta just do it again. Just fly it in. Oh, I wish there were, I, I'm going to put trees over there. I think I think eventually I'm going to put trees over on that side. Cause I think that'll just complete the look. This looks so cool. Oh, I'm so happy with this, oh, man. I am so happy. All right. So let's put, let's just put a little bit. How do you do this? Okay. There we go. I want the, the how do you, how do you get, how do you get a uh, leaf? You have to bone meal it. Maybe you have to bone meal it. Let's see. Bone meal. Mm-hmm. That gave us leaf. That gave, that gave us some some leaves. Um, hmm. eh, not not really what I was looking for. Uh, maybe if I do this, then leaf. Yes. Yeah, that's what I want. Okay, let's just chop this down. Let's start over. Redo. Bone meal. That's what I want. I want like low leaf action going on, and then we'll grab some string. This is. Pro tip with skunk right here. String on top. Boom. No, this is actually known tip. Um, I totally invented it. Uh, there we go. So just like that, a little something else, because I was looking at this and I was like, wait a minute. We need something a little, we need some vertical action because we got these trees that are very vertical, but we need something to kind of complement it a little bit. Oh yes. I think that is a job well done. <laughs> that really just completed the look the bamboo oh i love it especially since he's got bamboo up there i'm like you know this kind of fits in now it kind of makes it look all well rounded with all the little details this looks so good there's so much life going on over here oh i love it i love it it looks so nice hopefully you guys like it as well so this is our custom rainforest design here and uh maybe we, again like i said maybe we'll expand upon it in the future if puff wants us to of course you know oh that looks so good i, I wish this was my base now <laughs> i i don't know maybe i'll have to for next season i'll have to do a rainforest base from some sort maybe a, a jungle base this looks pretty cool this is so so cool oh i'd love to come back and do more for puff in the future i have super exciting news afterlife is officially on 1.21 oh yeah uh, finally our mods updated. Some of our mods updated. We're able to update. Yay. It's super exciting. <laughs> so you know what that means? We get new wolves. We get trial chambers. We get the mace. We get new paintings. Yep. That's exciting. Um, I actually did up, end up getting a, uh, trial chamber map already. You can see it there in my skunk valuable sugar box. Uh, but I'm going to be saving that for the afterlife stream day, which is going to be on July the 27th. 
So the day after this video is uploaded, um, that, that we'll be doing a stream day. And I'll be streaming, I believe, around 1 p.m. EST. Uh, but there will be an announcement in our Discord uh, announcing the official times and all that good stuff. So be sure to come by and join me on the stream day. I've been streaming more on Twitch as well. So, you know, go follow me over on Twitch. I've been doing more. I've been doing the live streams over there now. I, I was doing them on YouTube for a little bit, but now we're doing them on Twitch. Yeah. Um, yeah, that's exciting. Exciting stuff. Uh, but in the meantime, um, I'm going to save the trial chamber for our afterlife stream day, like I said. Uh, but, uh, in the meantime, we'll just look at some paintings. That's new. <laughs> right off the bat. Um, I just want to take a look at some of these paintings. Oh, that's great. That's wonderful. I haven't got to see them in game yet. I've got a little sneak peek of them, um, in other people's videos and stuff like that. But, uh, it's super exciting to kind of take a look and see. Is there another two by two? Oh, this is the one I love. I love this one. And the two by two with the cake. Oh, it's going to look... Some of these paintings are going to look so good. Like, it's just the decor. I'm super excited. That's new as well. Yeah, there's 15 new paintings, by the way, if I recall correctly. Is the Minecraft anniversary thing. Oh, that's pretty cool. Oh, this is this is so nice to have some new new paintings and stuff like that. Isn't there like a big boy as well? That's a big boy. That's a nice one. As well. I like that. Oh, yeah, look at that. Isn't that nice? Some of these are so cool looking. Um, I think that is, I think that's all the big boys. Yeah, I think that's everything. And then we get some, uh, one by ones as well. So let's, let's do a little, let's do this. Boop, boop. I think there's a one by one. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe there isn't a one by one. That's new. Mm-hmm. I love that. It's so simple. Is there more? I'm going to say no. I'm going to say no to that. There's 15 apparently. There's 15. No, I think that's, I think that's like pretty much, I, th I think we've seen most of them. So, uh, pretty cool. Pretty cool. I'm definitely going to be using some of these in the castle. Once we do the interior for the castle, these new paintings are going to be used, especially this one. This one looks so funny. <laughs> Well, that is going to do it for this episode, everyone. Uh, I appreciate you watching, as always. Um, be sure to check out the stream day if you're interested. Again, that is July 27th, a Saturday. So be sure to go check it out and, you know, go show some love to all the Afterlife members. Again, I might be, I, I believe I'm streaming at 1 p.m. EST. So that's, that's the time that I'll be streaming at. And we'll be doing some trial chambers with the other Afterlife members which is going to be super exciting. I'm excited about it. I can't wait to play. I can't wait to do the trial chamber on the stream day. So yeah, that's going to do it. As always, don't forget to be awesome. And I'll see y'all next time.